Welcome to Scrolling News. I'm your host Rob Laird, bringing you all the latest trending news from red tops to blue ticks and all the ridiculous content in between. Let's get the ball scrolling. Kicking off this week with Greta Thunberg, the young climate change activist, proving she does have a sense of humour. In response to Sky News claiming that pollution is causing penises to shrink, Greta tweeted, see you all in the next climate strike. Donald Trump responded, I've never been exposed to any pollution in my entire life. Nobody knows more about pollution than me. Too late, Donald. We've already seen your hands. All I can say is the air must have been very clear where I grew up. EastEnders actor and Cockney funny man Danny Dyer revealed details of his swollen ball, stating one of them looks like a fucking jacket potato. Jesus. <laughs> Imagine having that swing in between your legs. Careful not to sit on it, pal. Could give a whole new meaning to sausage and mash. That is a proper naughty bollock. Prince Harry and wife Meghan are still dominating every platform and paper following their Oprah interview, and it shows no sign of letting up. Conspiracy theorists wondering whether this could finally be the time the royals release the paternity test, proving James Stewart is in fact Harry's father. Ooh. In the US, Krispy Kreme are offering a free donut to anyone getting the COVID vaccination. I mean, let's be honest, the last thing Americans need is a donut. Imagine it. Well, I wasn't gonna get the vaccine, but now... Maybe if they offered the same deal here for SDI tests, there'd be less teens walking around scratching their balls. <laughs> now that would be one hell of a ball to scratch. Temperatures soared here this week, and if you thought the pandemic would stop the Brits from getting their sunshine, think again. Sunseekers packed every park and beach they could, and the rule of six quickly turned into the rule of 60,000. Now these are the same people who are going to be whinging when it puts us into lockdown three, so do us a favour, clean up your crap, and stick to the rules. Muppets. Two stories have me questioning what passes for entertainment this week. One woman becoming a TikTok sensation showing what household items she can hold up with her 34 double G boobs. Bet she's finding it hard to keep abreast of all her DMs. Then there's this woman. She makes $4,000 a month filming herself farting. That's a whole new occupation for the census form. Quite literally the epitome of stinking content. Well, that brings an end to our first ever show. I'm Rob Laird. Thank you for joining me and scroll on next week.